Vimos. The Forge. I knew I let you stay in the Animus too long. Your vitals are crashing. You don't understand. This confirms it. Cassandra didn't just have Isu technology. She had the means to improve it. Imagine how powerful the staff could be. I admit, that could be an incredible find. But right now, I'm the doctor, and I take care of you. Now get some rest before you go back to Cassandra. Don't tell me to rest. You're right, I'll take a break. Alright. If you insist, but only because I've got work to do on the outside. Please, just clear your head. The last thing we need is a cell leader suffering from the bleeding effect and spearing us because we're Hittites or Thracians. I won't. But Thracians throw great parties. Don't forget, we're a team. We'll back you up until you're finished your investigation. I know. Kyoshi secured the loft yesterday and he's keeping an eye out. Elena's on call doing historical research. And I'm here to talk if you're feeling any confusion from the Animus. Always the therapist. So, Doctor, how do you feel now that we're closer than ever to the staff? I believe this staff is important. But the Templars and Assassins have found staves of Eden before. Nikolai Tesla blew one up in Russia, if I remember correctly. This is different. If what I saw in Egypt is true, this staff doesn't control minds. It controls physics. Time. Imagine rewriting the rules of the universe. The spear you found is right here, and it's not doing anything. The spear is attached to a bloodline. Leonidas, Cassandra, and Themos, I mean, Alexios, they were intimately connected to it. Are you sure you can use the Staff of Hermes, then? No. But if the Templars get it, they won't stop until they find someone who can. So, what do you think of my new Animus? You mean, our new Animus? That's Abstergo equipment. Which I've modified to within a millimeter of its digital life. It's an Animus console prototype, Brahmin variant, with the I.O. capacities pushed to their max. Ultra portable with more calculating power than NASA and CERN combined. Hot damn. I'll go stretch my legs. Too bad we don't have access to the Abstergo gym anymore, huh? Membership costs too much. <laughs> nice. Alright, so I guess we'll take a look around. What is this? Oh, that's the uh, computer, I guess. I should check my email. Is that my computer, or is that... Okay, I'm assuming that's the, uh, that doctor's computer. What's this? The center of the universe, circa 400 BCE. Well, I wouldn't say universe. Center of the Western universe, maybe. Eagles are fine and all, but a pet monkey would be even cooler. Wait, isn't that... Uh, Phoebe's toy? Hmm. Interesting. How's it going out there? Well, no threats in view. I'm glad we could work together again. I believe our working methods are compatible. Are you still upset about our last run-in with Abstergo? I'm sorry, I didn't realize those hills in Quebec were so steep. But hey, you and your Yakuza reflexes saved us. Sorry, ex-Yakuza. We're all alive and our injuries have healed. That's what matters. Of course, I'll return to the Animus. Then follow the trail Irodotos left to find the staff. But there's so many possibilities. So many choices. There's no way to know which ones are right. You used to run part of the Japanese Brotherhood. What would you do? Take things one step at a time, observe then act, or kill everyone and search their pockets for answers. You decide. <laughs> nice. Thanks for watching our backs, Kiyoshi. I'll leave you to your work. I'll report in if Abstago drops by. Great. And what is... Ooh, night vision goggles. Looks third echelon. Or was it fourth? Is that a reference to something? Ubisoft. Did Ubisoft have a hand in the Splinter Cell series? Too bad we had to leave before we could drink some more caribou. Caribou? What the fuck are you talking about? Is that like a reference to like... Quebecois wine? I wonder if the Fry Twins would still recognize London. A rooftop's still a rooftop. Oh, maybe we're in London, the Fry Twins. Of course, Evie and uh, Jacob Fry. Hmm. <laughs> oh my god, are you serious? What? <laughs> what? <laughs> oh my god. What? 
Oh my god, I love it so much. It's so stupid, but I love it so much. Oh man. Fascinating. Layla, can you believe we're meeting Herodotos himself? I can. He sure does talk a lot. Is there anything I can help you with? So does what I'm seeing as Cassandra match your research? I had to tweak the animus to use what we have of the book as reference. That book is a lost work by Herodotos. He basically invented the concept of recording history. And other figures are matching up too. Cleon, Pericles. The chance to see the past firsthand is why I joined the Assassins. Most people would talk about justice or leaping across rooftops, but history is cool too. I've loved history since my grandpa told me stories about his grandpa back in Ireland. He was an adventurer and sailor, so I'm continuing the family tradition. I feel so lucky. You make your own luck, remember? Why do people keep telling me that? So I've met Irodotos, but I don't know much about him. He's brilliant. His histories are considered the foremost textbook of classical Greece. People have made their careers analyzing his words for some new perspective. To see him in his own world, walking in the polis, and... Sorry, but he's kind of a hero of mine. You can fangirl all you want. Yay! <laughs> I'll leave you to your work. If you need anything, just let me know. Alright, well I guess I'll check my email then. Oh, I like the shadow effect. Very cool, very well done. Alright, uh... Quebec Caper? I guess this is all the backstory stuff? Uh, I'm in. How'd you manage that? Let's just say I left a crypto key under the doormat in case Abstergo escorted me out. Was your hunch right? Yep, just in time I have the location, Notre Dame in Quebec. But I can't find the relic, I'm sure it must be there. Uh, I guess they don't have a Catholic on their team like you do. Hmm. Oh, I see, this is all just like backstory stuff about maybe the... Something that happened in Quebec, right. Okay, so... Oh, blood repository. Maybe this is where they went to collect a sample of someone's blood. Yoshi Takakura. Area clear. Slipped first responder. Nice work. Media's got their story. Managed to get the gold paint off, okay? Paint isn't a bother. It's the ringing in my ears. Can't believe you pulled that off. If you can't believe in a golden Kiyoshi angel flying overhead, what can you believe in? All right, and this is... Hier soir, un cambriolage a eu lieu à la basilique cathédrale Notre-Dame de Québec. Heureusement, les dégâts au bâtiment historique sont minimes. Le secrétariat de la paroisse rapporte que les malfaiteurs sont partis en laissant derrière la cible du vol. Or so they think. Hmm. Reality is a simulation. Uh, took a dive into the theories about a reality being a simulation and ended up on the weird end of the internet. I'm just gathering information at this point. Not all that I have found has been useful. It's hard to imagine the world we know being another layer of, a, of the animus, but it makes sense in its own way. Ten religious artifacts with supernatural powers, chilling top tens. Wow. <laughs> These fucking videos on YouTube. Miracles, just how real are they? These uh, relics have some kind of a story attached to them, good, bad, or divine. Right, okay. <laughs> In before no holy grail. <laughs> Alright. And some kind of like... Oh, magazine on ancient Greece. Simulation theory. Hmm. And it's just like a forum chat, I guess. Alright. Getting the team together. Harlan Cunningham, not this time, off-duty for personal reasons. I see... Alana Ryan. Wait, isn't she on our team? Speaks English, Latin, Ancient Greece, Sanskrit. Historian, rugby player, combat, combat attitude not yet evaluated. She's the, um, yeah, history person, right, that we just spoke to? And Kiyoshi Takakura. Speaks Japanese, English. Uh, VG hand-to-hand, -hand, bladed weapon, firearm skills, former Yakuza, undercover potential with cooking gas gastronomic skills, guest chef for a Quebec City restaurant or food festival. Yes, but make sure he doesn't overwork himself. 
off a recent uh, tough mission. And Victoria Bebeau from Quebec, Canada, speaks French, English, MD, psychiatry, PhD in neuropsychiatry, specialized in neural system approach to emotional um, memory function, personality structure, and psychopathology. Nice. Uh, left Abstrogo after the Ascendance event, recruited by William Miles for unprecedented expertise. William Miles, he's, I believe, the father of Desmond Miles, right, I think? Anyways, assigned to mission, remember if you kill her, then you'll be unemployed. <laughs> nice, packing for Greece. Okay, right, got it. And, yep. Herodoto sent his works. Okay, cool. Uh, email, you said. Email. Our next assignment. Dear Kyoshi. What? Okay, I guess that's a uh, reply. Dear Leila, Dr. Bibo contacted me. Sounds like we're in daycare. What? Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Too much. I'm sorry, guys. The last book of Herodotus. The Spear of Leonidas. If I didn't work for the assassins, I wouldn't believe it. I'm still not sure I believe it. But a little luck and a lot of research later, and we've got ourselves the archaeological find of the century. At least, we would if I could publish it. Right. And what is this? We are? Can I? Do I have anything in the trash? Nope. Okay. So, just emails then. Oh. How about I read this stuff in between episodes, and then maybe you guys can... I, I can, like, summarize or something. Um... Harlan. Oh, Harlan Cunningham. A lot been going on. Oh, right. I guess this is our correspondence. Uh, something about the personal stuff. Hmm. Okay. Well, if you guys want, you can just, like, kind of pause the video um, and read through this if, you want, um, if you're interested. Right. I guess maybe this guy's friend or someone who is uh, not doing so well? Memorial... For Charlotte, I don't know who that is. Doesn't really ring a bell. Your question was: There something that you wanted me to ask, or wanted to ask me? Okay, I see. And he refers to Kiyoshi, and that's Kiyoshi saying that he's available. Right. Okay. I guess they're not that long that I, I need to, like, you know, just read through everything in between episodes or something. That's from, uh, Victoria. Huh. Interesting. <laughs> okay, she didn't get the it's a trap joke. It's a trap! I see, so I guess Victoria's right from Abstergo. Yeah, yeah, I think we knew that. Mm-hmm. Oh, I see. Oh, she was called Dr. Daycare. I see. Team effort. Here she's really keen on staying busy, etc., etc. Okay, cool. Got it. Thanks. Uh, I think that's about all I need to know. Um, do I need to talk to Victoria? No, nope, I'm sorry. <laughs> this isn't back in ancient Greece. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, before we go in though, just gotta do one last thing. What? <laughs> okay, I'm good to go back into the Animus. Are you sure you want to go back into the Animus right now? I get the impression you'll be there a long time. Hell yeah. Yes, I'm ready to go back to Cassandra. All right. I'll be watching your back. Unless I have a reason to stay. Which I don't think I do? Hmm. Maybe I should have read the other stuff before I went in. Sounds so finalistic when you say that. Because there's no way for me to uh, get out of the Animus. Anytime I want, I don't think. Spear is stronger now. The cult won't stand a chance. Um, Cassandra, how do you know the spear's stronger? Leonidas' uh, spear. Upgrade the spear of Leonidas here at the Forge of 
Hephaestus using artifact fragments. Upgrading it increases your adrenaline and it unlocks more powerful abilities. Collect artifact fragments from defeated members of the Cult of Cosmos. Review the quest mem menu to track progress towards more spear upgrades. Oh, I see. Okay, so now I can do higher level stuff. Ah, oh, I can. Ah, damn it. I thought at this point I'd have um, Man at Arms uh, level 2. Oh, well. Okay, um, I'd say let's upgrade our critical assassination for sure. What is this? Huh. Never seen that before. Was that always there? I don't think so. Mm, plus 7% seven, uh, 7 health gain per adrenaline spent. Whoa, I didn't realize that we actually gained um, uh, health for spending adrenaline. And second melee ability wheel unlocked. Oh, at the next level. Oh my god, we gotta beeline it towards that. Oh! All right, well, let me get an upgrade on Revelation. So now, okay, the last one is just higher range. Eh, not as and not as exciting as I thought it would be. All right, fine. So Shield Breaker next level will let me break all shields. But I think maybe getting more health would be probably a better choice. All right, and then we'll get uh, Shield Breaker next. And then Rush Assassination next. And, uh, yeah, go from there. Nice. I am... Oh, wait! Shit, I have another ability point. Oh, man. Okay, I said uh, Shield Breaker next, right? Let's do it. Fantastic. I am so titillated right now. All right, let me break down some of this crap that I have that I don't really want. Thank you. The purple stuff I'll sell, obviously, and... No, rusty... Wait, I can't... Why can't I break that down? Is that unique or something? Hmm, interesting. Alright, well, it must be unique then. We'll break that down. And we'll break this down as well, thank you very much. And, uh, like I said, we'll wait until we get this engraved to then uh, switch over to that thing. Alright. Okay, cool. I have another... Uh, like, fragment? Can I not use it now, or... Or what? Oh, I guess I, I don't have enough uh, fragments then. Alright, cool. Oh, can I use it here? This imprint is shaped like the sword Demos had at the cultist's meeting. Was it forged in this place? Oh. Huh. Interesting. What is this? I can't really see the... Is it an axe? That looks either like an axe or a hal halberd kind of thing. And this must be a hammer or a double-headed axe. Hmm. Fascinating. And I wonder if the island of well, Andros... The will be happy. It's clear someone was here far before we were. Andros. I wonder if Andros means like man, like Isle of Man. Like as in this was where... First man? Did you mean know this place existed? was created I mean I doubt that's the case but hmm I would like to understand the etymology of the name time to talk You're not hard to track. Did you come alone? Are you all right? <laughs> Alexios, you're alive. Don't touch me. <laughs> come on, little brother. You have to tell me everything. What's happened to you? I don't have to tell you anything. I don't know you. Well, I know you. It doesn't matter. There's more important things to argue about. You're right. Like that stunt you pulled with the artifact. It got my attention, if that's what you wanted. What? The artifact showed the truth. We're family. 
And we made it out of Sparta alive. <laughs> yes, it did show the truth. It confirmed what I always knew. You threw me off a fucking mountain. I didn't do that. You think it's that simple? Come on, Alexios. Let's talk about it. Stop calling me that. I already know what happened that night. Right. Demos. Now him, I don't know. He's a demigod. Worshipped and feared by the cult and all the Greek world. Hmm. Gods don't bow to the cult. That's not who you are. I don't know if I want to antagonize him. This sounds like it's very antagonistic. It sounds like a fantasy to me. Did the cult cook that story up too? I'd watch your fucking mouth, or I'll shut it for you. You didn't when you had the chance before, and I bet you won't now. This is stupid. We need to find our mother. I'm not interested in reunion. I just want to know what you think you're doing. Same thing as your cult. Looking for Mirini, our mother. They don't need her. Your cultists think differently. She's their next target. If they ever pursued her, it would be to kill her. But if you don't know where she is, that means she abandoned you, too. How sad. She didn't abandon me. She thought I was dead. Even if we were abandoned, we survived. We can go back to the way things were if we can find her. The cult has no interest in sentimentality or family. Its only aim is control. Hmm. I've never found Nikolaus. I killed Nikolaus. I don't want to lie. If it's true they're after us, tell them they'll never find Nikolaus. He's off the map. Trust me, I've searched myself. If I could find you, the other long lost child of Nikolaus, then I can find him. And when I do, he'll wish he was thrown off that mountain. I don't care what you think. I'll find Mirini. Do the right thing. Come with me. What? We could find her. Together. You could help me. <laughs> oh, you think friendship is the answer? Running around like lost children looking for dear mother. You're so weak. It's responsibility, not weakness. I won't abandon the whole family just for spite. Responsibility? Get off your high horse! The cult has a plan, and it won't be interrupted by the likes of you. Hmm. Taking your own mother isn't enough for them? We're not abductors. We're political. Those who don't stand with us, stand against us. And they pay for that mistake. Like me. Like you. I heard you're planning a trip to Athens. When you go, tell Pericles and his elitist scum they're next. The cult let Mirini live. They let Nikolaos live. Why kill them now? Because you live. You brought this on her and yourself. The cult is powerful, but they're mortals. I have the blood of gods, so they think you do too. But they'll see how wrong they are. Uh, okay. I'm going after the cult, you know. You've seen our numbers. You've seen what I can do. And you still think you stand a chance? Try me. So having guts runs in the family, does it? <laughs> you claim we have the same blood. So let's see what you can do. Oh no, don't fight me. No, no. Don't fight me. Not like this, Alexios. Not like this. We still found each other, brother. I told you not to touch me. Ugh, Malaka. Herodotus won't believe this. I have to tell him what happened. That fucker just slapped me? Unfucking believable I can't believe it, he just slapped me! Oh my god, the only thing to console me now is this... ...person with a spear stab- or <laughs> with a sword stab through his skull. <laughs> Alright, well, before I move on though... Hello, Chimera. 
we gotta go after her. Hell yeah. Because I think she's part of the, um, part of the uh, snake branch or whatever. The Cult of Cosmos. And I'm not sure if there's any undiscovered locations in the, um, in, uh, and in the, uh, on the island of Andros. Andros Island, or whatever the hell it's actually called. Alright, well, let's do it. Um, I'm hoping that it's not a gigantic fort that I have to go through to, um, to get this person assassinated, because I don't really feel like going through a giant fort right now. Though I did do a lot of talking and, well, you know, reading in this episode, so maybe a fort won't be such a bad thing. I guess we'll see once we get a little closer. Oh, I can see what um, Erodotos meant about the whole, uh, what's it, island being famous for the most uh, expensive marble. It's just all over the place. Holy crap, holy. Alright, please don't let it be a fort. Or please do, or whichever, I don't know. I guess whatever it is, it'll be what it is, yeah. right? No amount of begging one way or another is going to uh, change what this uh, thing actually is. Oh my god. Yeah. And Rodney's alive! And <laughs> we're about to get mauled by a lion? A cougar? I'm not quite sure which. Okay. We're close. Beach encampment. Okay, so at least it's not a fortress. But there's a few cultist guards and uh, some captives. Right, right. Let's try to get this assassination done right. And let's keep in mind that I'm actually capable of um, a lot of assassination damage, or more assassin damage than before. Okay, where is... Okay, that's the last one. So... Okay, over this way? There we go. So, uh, Captain, Guard, Guard, and uh, the Chimera. Alright, let me uh, wait until it's night. Maybe the, maybe one of them will be asleep. Oh, don't think I've ever had this uh, meditation screen before. Interesting. Alright, cultist. I see you, you son of a bitch. Alright, let's get him first. Fantastic. And we're going to put him in the bushes. Uh, let's put him a little further out. Sorry, farther out. My bad. Right here, my good man. Right here. Hmm. Now the captain guy. I'm not quite sure if I can do... ...enough damage to kill him in one fell swoop. Hmm. But it seems like the Chimera is kind of by herself. I wonder if perhaps I can lure her? Because I don't know if I can really kill her last. But with her uh, being sta just standing there. Unless I can uh, attract the, uh, the captain somehow. Okay, this guy's coming in this way. So let's see where he goes next. And then we'll figure... Okay, no, the Chimera actually moves. Interesting. Hmm. Did he just discover... Shit. Okay. It's another one dead. Fantastic. Let's hide his body quickly. Thank you. Yeah, I think we're gonna need to take out the Chimera before we take out the, uh... Uh, the captain. Fair enough. Let's do it up. She's dead. Oh, fuck. Ah, uh, damn it. How the hell did this guy know? What the hell, dude? Alright, now that I can uh, destroy your shield, get out of here. Cremon. What a weird ass name. You like to cream on things, bitch? Alright, please catch on fire. Nope. Sadly, he did not. Alright, I can still fix that, though. <laughs> nice. Uh, who's gonna help you now, bitch? Who's gonna help you now? Not me, that's for sure. Oh, shit. Nice. Oh, damn. Okay, that one hit me. But that's fine. You suck, buddy. 
Cremon. What a name. Shit. <laughs> there you go, buddy. Come on. Let's do this. Fantastic. Dead as shit. Yeah, she's definitely dead. I mean, her face is right in the uh, campfire. There's no way she's surviving well, that. I enjoyed that. Yes, I did. And I got the boots of Agamemnon. Fantastic. Get out of here, captive. Alright, I'm gonna loot all this shit. Don't you dare report this to the authorities. Alright, get out of here. You too. Sacrificial lambs or whatever the hell you guys were meant to be. Fantastic. And... Dunzo. Perfect. Get out of here, people. Good grief, stop hanging out like that. Making me... Gag on my own spit or something. I don't know what's going on here. Alright, um, so let's head back to our boat. The Adrestia. And, um... Wait, do we have a new hint about the next cultist on the, um... On the line there? Hmm. Oh, right, right, so, uh, the Chimera was not, in fact, the, uh... The cultist that I thought she was. Okay, so I thought... She was somewhere around here. And this would give us the, uh... The snake stuff, right? But no, she was here. And that's the Agamemnon stuff. Alright, so who's this guy? Still don't know, know anything uh, or enough about this one. Alright, cool. But we've discovered something about the undiscovered sage. Interesting. Okay. Hmm. What are the boots of Agamemnon, though? Warrior damage, fire damage, burning rate. Wow, these legendary boots once belonged to King Agamemnon as part of his personal armor set. Okay kind of freaky to have faces on my knees, but why not, right? Why not? But that being said, because it lowers my assassin damage, I'm not too interested. And I don't really use, uh, intend to use a lot of fire stuff, despite the fact that I just burned a man with a torch, but still. I'm kind of hoping I could go more down the poison path a bit more, but that'll be for later. Hey, bud. Well, was the legend true? Was it magnificent? What happened to you? And your spear. Slow down, Irodotos. My spear's stronger now. I can feel it. You were right. There was some kind of artifact there. It showed me a vision. Of me and my mother. So, the ancient civilization is real. Cassandra, you have no idea the power you possess. All harnessed in Leonidas' spear. That's not everything. Demos followed me here. The cult's already moving, he told me himself. They're going after us. My family, Pericles. Why would he tell you? Unless it was a trap. It doesn't matter. We have to get to Athens to warn Pericles. And we need to find my mother before they do. Then, we go to the Penix. If Pericles is anywhere, he's there. Whoa, okay. And why would Alexios tell me all this, though? That's my question. And not, like, you know, tussle with me. I wonder if perhaps he believes Cassandra in some capacity. That could be it. Alright, so what new quest did I get? Uh, not that stuff. I'm assuming it's part of the Odyssey, right? Okay. The road to the Symposium. It was certain now that the cult's threat was imminent, they were coming. Not only were they after Cassandra and her mythic bloodline, but they wanted Pericles, father of, a, of democracy, too. Meeting him was crucial. After meeting uh, Demos face to face, Herodotos and Cassandra headed to Pericles, leader of Athens, in the hopes he would have information on the whereabouts of Cassandra's mother. And that's the uh, Spear of Leonidas stuff. So I have to upgrade the spear by um, collecting more stuff? Wait, do I have another piece of the Cult of Cosmos? Oh, I do! Oh, man, okay, well then I should definitely upgrade the spear now, shouldn't I? Alright, well then, um... Yeah, okay, fine. You know what? 
how about we dock it? Increase speed. We do the uh, spear upgrade and then we'll end Ready the episode. I think that might be a good idea. Unless maybe the spear requires more pieces before it actually gets upgraded? Eh, only one way to find out. Alright, let's do this. I might be a few minutes over time. Hope you guys don't mind. But I did spend like a good 20 minutes, um, you know, in the real world, interacting with that statue that made uh, uh, Layla go, What? I still can't get over how amazing that experience was. Thank you, Ubisoft. Thank you. That alone has sold me on this game. <laughs> I love it. Oh my god. It's the simple things in life, you know? No need for that every time, guys. Alright? I'm well aware of my amazing presence in the uh, ancient forge. Okay, well then let's go ahead and wait. How come I didn't get uh, cultist fragments from the last one that we killed? The um, the one uh, that was surrounded by the uh, Spartan soldiers in um, in Megara or Megaris rather. Why do I keep saying Megara? What is Megara? I don't know. Um. Unless maybe you get a new piece after you kill a certain number of cultists, maybe? Hmm, that could be it. Alright, well, that's fine. Forge activated. Synchronizing retransmission chronosity. Contact engaged. Alright, so is our spear level 3 now? Okay, I got like almost 11,000 experience points. <gasps> is it level 3? Please. What? what? Where? Where is the- Oh, it's in the abilities section, right? <gasps> it's level 3! Oh my god, guys. Joyous day. Oh, we did it. We did it! Oh! Ah, oh, I just creamed my pants. Alright, let me assign this into... Aha! There we go. Alright, we'll assign it to that one, because I can only use it during uh, stealth stuff. Fantastic. Now this one will go into slot B then. Nice. We did it. Holy shit, I am so, so very stoked. Alright, well, let's end the episode off here for now. We'll come back- whoa. Okay, I see. I see. Oh, Okay, so we have to collect several more fragments before we can upgrade it even further. Okay, that's cool. Um, well then, let me head out of here and then end the episode. In between episodes, I will um, fast travel over to uh, our boat. And uh, next episode, we will head on over to... Um, save Pericles, I guess, who is apparently the founder of Athens, or no, the leader of Athens, and the founder of, what is that, Spotlight, and possibly the founder of Ancient Democracy? I don't know, we'll see. Alright, so for now, thanks for watching and have a good breakfast!